prepare to witness the horrific rise of the next generation of evil. Based on the short story, by Stephen King, comes the nightmare like you've never seen it before. I know, it sucks. It's so hard sometimes you can hardly breathe. But I can help with your pain. Brace yourself. He who walks, he talked to me. He took care of me. So now I'm going to take care of him. By killing all the adults. For starters. What's the job? We're gonna destroy their whole nuclear program. Breaking news exposing the CIA's sabotage of Iran's nuclear reactor. Our cover is blown. We leave in 15 minutes. Stretching point. There's an old CIA base in Kenar. I just want to go home, and I'll be with you. The distance is not the main issue. It's what's in between. I didn't even catch my guys. I'll sell them to the highest bidder. No one is coming to rescue us. We have to get to Kandahar. As a private contractor, you possess a unique set of skills. You said it was clear. I said the front was clear. Ah. Front, back, right, wrong. Anyway, shall we? I have another job for you. So what we got? Greg Simmons. It's a billionaire arms dealer. Oh, a lot of very serious faces up here, aren't there? You can't catch this fish with conventional lures. I'm sorry? The lure being? Danny Francesco. <laughs> the movie star. Greg Simmons' favorite movie star. And how do we get him? Blackmail. Who's to get? Very good. Carry on. The world needs you for your greatest role yet. Who are you? I'm your new manager. There's a sensitive and awkward situation between you and your sister-in-law. I actually love my sister-in-law. Yes, Danny. You made that quite evident. When marimba rhythms start to play. No need to be nervous. No reason to be nervous. Make me swing. They're all the killers. You're an actor. Act. Would someone pinch me, please? Is that Danny Francesco? What's next for you? I'm playing a mysterious self-made billionaire. He just described me. Shadow me. Do whatever I do. Whatever I do, do. Whoever Greg was buying from was amongst you last night. I can get inside of them. I hope you take them to dinner first before you get inside of them. Sexually. When we swear, I You recognize your awesome fortune. That is a sexy name. Cover's blown. What do I do? 
the movie star's gonna melt. You stop Danny Francesco. You stop Brick Simmons! You let me worry about that. What are you gonna do with that? I'm gonna shoot at them, Danny. So you weren't seen by anyone? Yes. That's a yes? You weren't seen by anyone? Yes. Or a yes, you were seen by someone? Yes. You, have we met? My memory's a little fuzzy. Are you still a Nazi? the desert. I miss the sea. And I miss waking up every morning wondering what wonderful adventure the new day will bring to us. Those days have come and gone. Perhaps, perhaps not. I don't believe in magic. But a few times in my life, I've seen things. Things I can't explain. And I've come to believe it's not so much what you believe. It's how hard you believe it. I'm her godfather. Related. Get back. Remember? And if you don't know, now you know. We're too high up. We can't get down from here. isn't like any other ghost face. What is this place? It's a shrine. Guys? We've got to lure him in. We execute him. Come on, mother! Scream. It's for you. Only in theaters March 10th. Tickets on sale now. Okay, get in here. I don't know how you sleep with all these lights. What are you scared of? I don't see anything. Okay, monster check complete.
It's been around forever. Hidden. In the dark. It's like all those spooky monsters you think are hiding under your bed. It's not real. It's the thing that comes for your kids when you're not paying attention. You believe me? Don't you? Ladies and gentlemen, stay tight as a group, and when I say we go, we go. We're getting closer to the heat than any other tour company. Let's go! Everybody in the van! <laughs> You're welcome. Your parents are the reason I started chasing. But did you know about this? It can save lives. You know how dangerous this world is. Who goes out onto a roof to get close to the sky? Hey! So you thought it would be a good idea to turn this thing on and see what happens? That's what Dad did. Just get me within range. You came to be a storm chaser, just like your dad. He's not here, is he? Well, let me come with. I can help. Rule number one. Always make sure you got at least a half a tank of gas. Rule number two, make sure you got an escape. Two! To the inside! So what's rule number three? Never get caught in the bear's cage. We need a shelter now. Welcome to the backside of a supercell. Be chased for knowledge, not thrill. Get out of there now! Buckle up. We're going to war. So why'd you call me out here? A couple of days ago, I get a letter from Grandad. It's marked about a month before he died. I made sure you get this letter to know my dying wish, that my acres of land are given to the local Aboriginal tribe. They've been a great help with my research. There's this local developer. He wants to buy the land off me. Tristan, you understand that Grandad's property has been in the family for generations. In Grandad's letter, he said the local Aboriginal tribe helped him with his research. What do you mean by research? What was that? We better go inside. It turns out my grandfather was a cryptozoologist. Someone who researches mythical creatures. He studied bunyips. This developer, what's he uh, gonna be um, developing? You know what this is worth to the company? This creature was what killed your grandfather. Now, Mr. Richards wants nothing more than to stop this thing before it can kill again. So this thing, still out there? It always is and always will be. It's been said that humans are the only species with a true understanding of the concept of time. But as it turns out, time is actually rather, rather malleable. 
What is time, in reality, other than a concept of our own interpretation? This pill allows us to interpret that sense of time differently. An hour here for an hour there. Today, tomorrow, forwards, backwards, consciousness, time travel. All right, what is this, really? Time travel pills? You're a son of a bitch, you know that? What do you want, Lee? I got a job. It's a big one. It's called Consciousness Time Trading, or CTT. The pill allows you to trade minds with your future self for one hour. When you're in your brain tomorrow, tomorrow you is in your brain today. I steal info from tomorrow and bring it back to today. So you're a thief? Yeah. The pill's called Z+. Take it today, you'll wake up tomorrow. And then tomorrow, you'll wake up today. Purple means you're jumping forward. Green means you're jumping backwards. Any questions? This is a race. A race for the future, do you understand? It is gonna be fine. <laughs> you seem quite strong-willed. I'm also strong-willed. I thought I was done dealing with you, Lee. Hard to get rid of. What are you doing? We'll be back tomorrow. Tomorrow? 11 seconds for you. Ladies and gentlemen of the board, this is Paul Carpenter. Glad you found us. And what makes you think you'll be suited to this position? Coincidence? Really? Go on. Well, oh, bloody alarm! And my shoelace broke. No. Twice. A dog stole my scarf. Hey! Grab that dog! And here I am. Well, well, this has been a truly forgettable experience. Bloody hell. I can't jump! Ah, you will be working for the most innovative company in history. We control their gut instincts. We arrange coincidences. Is that what you do here? Make people fall in love? Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> That's why she's in our fast track program, and you, Paul, are not. I've lost something immeasurably valuable. It's one of the most powerful and coveted items ever to exist. Found you. Knock, knock. It's a door, a portable door to be specific. You're not to share this with anyone. Can I trust you? So it goes wherever you want to go. This has just become the best job in the world. Come on! <laughs> a portable door. When you fail, there are no words to describe what Mr. Wells will do to you. If you do find it, this is who you come to. This company is at war with itself. <laughs> We were able to influence this consumer. Imagine what we can do to the masses. I can find a way out. That's what I do. No! Knock, knock! Who closes the door keeps the door. Do you have any idea what they do here? Oh! What? Can you tell me a scary story? Once upon a time, there was a little girl and she lived in a big house in the countryside. One dark and very creepy night. Dad? She heard a noise.
and I don't know what it is, but Nana knows something about it. Nana's going to bed, so no wandering around, okay? Okay. shift? Nope. Just you. you, you, you. She's stuck in here. Let's find her. She in here. She's close. has been a tough year. Our sales are down, our growth is down. Sonny, I brought you in here to grow the basketball business. People don't know what the hell a Nike is. What's a Converse? NBA All-Star shoe. There's nothing cool about Nike. You would have to have a pretty compelling pitch. I can tell them the one thing the other companies can't compete with. Our basketball division is terrible. I do not love it. This is where you come up with a brilliant idea that no one else can see. Let's hear it. I got it. I found him. Who's that? Jesus? Can't afford it. I'm willing to bet my career on one guy. My name's Sonny Vaccaro. I'm with Nike. Do you typically make it a habit of showing up at people's front doors unannounced? I don't like to take no for an answer. Oh, man. Here we go. You ask me what I do here. This is what I do. I find you players, and I feel it this time. Yeah, okay, it's risky. When you were selling sneakers out of the back of your Plymouth, that was risky. Don't change that now. For a rookie? Yes. Who's never set foot on an NBA court. If that's the literal definition of rookie. Yeah. What's the plan? We build a shoe line around just him. I need the greatest basketball shoe that's ever been made. Who's the player? Michael Jordan. Your motor is I believe in your son. I believe he's the future. And his story is gonna make us want to fly. But a shoe is just a shoe. Until my son steps into it. Got a name for it? Air Jordan. I don't know. Seriously? Well, maybe it'll grow on me. Motor.